What's up, cooks? It's Wednesday. Yes, we do have the Cuisinart Complete Chef in the kitchen. This is Cuisinart's cooking food processor. It's sort of a competitor of a lot of these uh, multifunction machines that are coming out now. This one's unique because not only is it a cooking food processor with a chopping blade, it's a full function food processor. So it has all our slicing blades, uh, shredding, all that. So I got this at Williams Sonoma and I am very anxious to try it out. So today it's What's Up Wednesday and we're going to unbox this baby and get our first look at the complete chef uh, from Cuisinart. So these cooking food processors have been getting a lot of attention lately. There is one over in the UK, uh, the Thermomix, and it, they use, a lot of people use that. And these kind of machines are just making their way over here to the US. We've looked at a couple of them. Um, one of those cooking magazines recently did a review and they say that the Cuisinart is their pick and we're going to be trying that out here in the Amy Learns to Cook kitchen. So what's interesting about this is, like I said, a lot of these that I've used just have the chopping blade in them. This is a full function food processor with the cooker cooker in it. So you can slice, you can shred, you can all, do all that in with this machine. Um, chop, mix, puree, knead, slice, shred. It even has a dicer. So this is the one of the most complete um, of these cooking food processors that I've seen. And I'm looking forward to this. We bought this at the Williams Sonoma outlet. This is a expensive machine. Like this machine is going for like up in the $700 price range. I got it at the outlet. I think we got it 30% off. I got a great deal on it. And, um, we just bought it one day when we went in there. So, it has this menu here that guides you through recipes. Um, wow, I just, I wanna take a look at this baby. So let's, let's work on getting this out of the box. Okay, so I've wanted to try this machine out for quite a while. This box is so big, I just moved it over here. <laughs> so we have, let the games begin, right? We have, <laughs> we have the user manual. Quizart's user manuals are usually pretty good. Um, sometimes they have recipes. This one doesn't. And it comes with a really nice scraper spatula. Usually sometimes these are just kind of junky, but this is really nice. Oh, my word. Let the fun begin. Uh. This thing is quite big. <laughs> okay. Whoa, okay. Yeah, it looks like this you're dragging is, out. We're dragging the cat out, right? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. My mistake was all the weight was in the motor, but I think that bowl is heavy. It's got something in there. Wow. <laughs> okay, so here's the motor. This thing is pretty 
cool looking. It kind of reminds me of the elemental line, which I can tell you is not my favorite Cuisinart line. Um, hopefully it doesn't operate like that. So here is this thing. I'm assuming there's a sticker on here. Yes, I'm yeah. Ugh. Okay. Okay, so that's the motor. And here's the bowl. This thing is heavy. Oh, lovely. Um, so this is the Cuisinart Complete Chef, the food processor that cooks. Um, take the lid off. Okay. Uh, one thing I do like is the lid is glass, so um, you can see in there better. I'm not sure what this is. Looks like a vent or something. Um, here we have a steaming basket. Wow, okay, so here's the bowl. But it's kind of heavy though. Yeah, the bowl is really heavy. I guess the bowl just goes on like that. Yay. Okay. Yay. And the lid goes on like that. Okay, let's try this out. Um, I'm going to have this upside down. So, well, okay, this must be the dicer. Um, yeah, I think this is the dicer. So, if we open this up, this is pretty cool that it has a dicer because I haven't seen this on the other ones. Um, so, this looks like the cleaning thing for the dicer. Here's your uh, dicer. <laughs> and here's the blade for it. Be careful. Wow. Yeah. Wow, that is a pretty hefty blade there. Yeah. Um, phew, medium or small pusher only. Okay. So that's the dicer. What do we have here? Well, okay, this is a lid. Oh, this is a this must be the lid when you're using it as a food processor. So it's got um, a wide feed tube. It has a medium and a small. So this is the lid you use as a cooker, and this is a lid you're going to use when you're using it as a food processor. Okay, so this is our, um, whoa, okay. This is the blade box. And it has a little lock here. This is a KitchenAid Pro line is like that. Whoa, okay. Yeah, we got all kinds of stuff. So here's a, this looks like a dough blade. Um, here's a shredder. Here's a, an adjustable slicing blade. Don't want to cut myself here. So you can adjust the thickness of the blade here. Uh, we have a, here's a chopping blade. Here's some other kind of dough blade. This must be the post. And here is a whip. Wow. Okay. Can I put 
this back together. <laughs> wow, that's pretty sweet. I really like it. I've had food processors we don't get a case to put all the tools in, so then you're going to lose them, right? Um, wow, let me plug this thing in and we'll take a look at the menu. So you have to pick what mode that you want it to be in. So they have food processor mode, cook mode, recipe mode, and your settings. So your recipes, you can search, if you just list all recipes, you can go down the list. You can go down the list and say, we want to make risotto and it's going to show us the recipe. We can list the ingredients, the nutrition information, or you can start the recipe. So this will tell you everything that's in the uh, recipe and you can go through a guided cook um, by just hitting get started. Um, so if you wanna do a manual cook, you can just do that, do custom cook, and you can program time, temp, and speed. Or you can run it through the food processor and chop chop, slice, shred, or dice. Puree, dough, whisk. Awesome. And this is your pulse, your high, low for your food processor buttons. Okay, so we're just gonna try this out really quick, like it's a food processor. I'm gonna put the toast in here. And I'm gonna put the blade on here. And I'm gonna put the lid on here. And I'm put on food processor. to try in this baby out. I'm going to play around with it a little bit just so I can become familiar with what this thing can do. And then we'll do a couple recipes in this. We might do something out of the recipe library and then we'll do a custom recipe. So cooks, we have the Cuisinart Complete Chef cooking food processor in the Amy Learns to Cook kitchen. We've tried some of these out, but this is you know, this is a little different because it's a full function food processor as well as a cooker. So I'm looking forward to trying this out. So what's up? It's Wednesday. I hope you have a fantastic day.